At times as an entrepreneur, we need to zoom in to a particular task and zoom out for a bigger to take bigger perspective like goal setting, planning, uh, monitoring, performance, etc. And it becomes especially difficult in a situation where all of these things are happening in your head. In this video, uh, I will talk about how to create, monitor and track your goals easily into Notion. A Notion is a database management system and a task management system which could really simplify uh, project management, goal settings, task management as an entrepreneur with ease. Hi, I am C.A. Piyush Bansal. I help entrepreneurs optimize their business and life. Let's jump into the concept. This video would be distributed into two parts. The first part would be talking about the concepts that I'll, I've been using for setting and monitoring goals. And uh, then second part would be uh, the tour of the notion where I'll talk about the template that I've been using for setting goals for mon uh, and, and monitoring them in that perspective. So let's uh, start with the core concepts first. The first concept that I want to talk about is that as an entrepreneur, we need to strike balance in different areas of our life. And our life is not just relating to business. It's split into seven other areas, which could be your business, personal finance, recreation, learning, spirituality, and contribution. In all these areas, we need to strike balance so that we can uh, be in tune in our life and be able to achieve what we really want to achieve as in a bigger perspective. Second thing that I want to talk about is OKR. OKR is a great concept by John Doerr. This is a book, Measure What Matters. It talks about how you can define specific objective and key outcomes to those specific objectives so that it becomes measurable and trackable. It says what get measures get that, uh, it, that gets done. And the similar concept, it talks about how we can set up organizational goals, which can further be split into different functions like marketing functions, sales function, operation, accounts, HR, and so on. And how to keep a track of it in that context. Third concept that I've been using for goal setting is called smart concept. This is a good framework that use, uh, which is universally accepted and many people among us know. Um, which talks about that the goal should be very specific, measurable, achievable, realistic and time specific. Having said that, the last concept that I want to talk about is GTD. It's, it's a concept taken from getting things done. It's a book. Uh, uh, it's a very good book on task management. And uh, both of the books that I've been talking about, I'll just share a link to the specific uh, books in the description below and you can check it out over there. So under the GTT, it talks about how uh, all the tasks need to be specified into uh, different buckets and every goal should have a specific project and all the projects should have a specific task and all these things should be aligned and synced with each other so that you have a good picture of how things are happening and how you need to get things done. So with these four concepts into account, um, uh, I'll be using uh, goal setting and monitoring in that perspective. A notion is a good template, uh, a project management, task management, a goal setting tool that I use in my organization and in my personal life to get things done and achieve what I want to do. Now this template has been distributed into three main sections, one which is the goal, projects and task. And all these three are in sync with each other. Let me show you how. So the first database I create is of my goals, which gives me a bigger picture uh, perspective of what are my uh, goals that I want to accomplish. So first goal that I can talk about is my business goal, which talks about creating brand awareness. So for meeting this goal, the outcome that I look for is creating one video each week. This, this, these are the very specific, actionable and measurable tasks that happens as a result which uh, will help you achieve your overall goal. And then these goals outcomes could be also measured. Like for example, if I have to create one video each week, there could be uh, in total 52 weeks in a year, uh, I'll have to create 52 videos. And if I say uh, 
20 videos have been created it will show me how much percentage of this specific outcome has been accomplished and then I can give a specific due date to it and I can assign a specific project which could be YouTube video this uh, specific project is directly linked with this specific uh, line item over here which talks about uh, what is my uh, which is this area covering which is the priority these are the taggings which are there in this specific project for uh, for managing and planning it in that context for which specific year I am doing it for and for which specific goal I am doing it for this could be easily be uh, uh, mapped with those specific areas so this is the goal that we will be taking care of so um, and not only this it will also give you a good list of tasks which are there in the specific uh, project like for example capturing ideas creating video publishing a video on youtube this could be specific task that is mapped in the specific project and then so you can access it from anywhere either you can directly when you are reviewing your goals you can check into your projects what are the projects that are happening and you can just have a good glance of what are the project status how things are going on and similarly you can do the same under the projects respective projects also where you can see a good perspective of what are the projects that are going on right now and how you need to manage those projects accordingly and then finally comes the stage of task which gives you all the tasks which are there in all your projects and what are the status of those specific tasks now in this you can specifically assign it to a specific person or you can create different level of views and functionalities into it to plan it so that is how you are able to design your create your goals and then you can monitor these goals in terms of how things are happening and you can easily track it in terms of which projects and tasks is it uh, aligned to so this is a very good way of uh, managing of creating and tracking your goals in a given perspective uh, if you have any specific questions around the tool or the notion that we are talking about or the process that we have been using for it uh, you can uh, put in the comments below and I will be happy to answer them and if you need any other uh, uh, tutorials or videos around this specific concept I will be happy to make videos around it also so if you have liked this video um, and if you like the way I have been placing things so the whole idea for me is that I want to help business owners and optimize their business and life. So for that perspective, you are liking these kind of videos and you want more such videos for uh, your personal use, then you can sign up to our newsletter by clicking on the link below in the description. And you will get one video each week directly to your mailbox along with the free resources and materials that I'll be talking about in that context. Thank you.